Emil Karch, the captain of Vida Vuj. Emil Karch meets with Suava Mirsaliga. Captain of Vida Vuj wins the toss. And shakes all round. You can see the uh, smiles on the faces of the match officials led by Bartosz Frankowski and the two skippers. It's the first game of the day. Peter Vuj against Krakowia Krakow. Later this evening, we see Jagiellonia Białystok play host to Gornik Zabcia. Gornik currently second in the league standings. And they can propel themselves to the top above Legia Warsawa with three points later tonight. For the moment, though, this is the main event. Let's see what will be treated with. There is the boss of Krakowia Krakow, Wojciech Stavovi, who took Krakowia back to the extra class in June 2013 after a one year break. 27 year old former Krakowia player. He's known for his tactical nice. In fact, this is his second spell as boss of Krakowia now. There is Rafał Pavlik, the current interim boss, who took over from Mirosław Mirowski on the 26th of uh, September. Of course, these difficult times for Ovidevoj. Just one place off the bottom, two points ahead of Pobodzicki. Krakowia Krakow, the visitors playing from left to right as we look in the sky blue jerseys, the white shorts and white socks. Now we can see the league positions confirmed. Sixth place Krakowia and some way off sixth or 15th place Videvuj. Six points, incidentally, separates the uh, sides here this evening. Here is Swapomir Saliga, the captain of visiting Krakowia. Krakowia instantly getting in possession. Saliga, can he get his cross in? And the uh, touch was just slightly heavy by David Novak. 28-year-old with eight Polish caps, looking for his sixth goal of the season. Just couldn't take the ball under his spell there. And uh, Vidovic come away with possession. Next break in play. Give us an opportunity to take you through the two team lineups here tonight. One change apiece, as we mentioned. Nice turn by Sebastian Stiblecki. So Krakowa playing from left to right in the sky blue colours. Christoph Pilarts in goal. Selega, Kosanovic, Zitko and Marciniak across the back. Nabonkiza, Strauss, Dabrowski, Voljevic, the one change for Krakowia. He has come in this evening for Marcin Budzinski. And Sebastian Sebleki completes the midfield lineup with David Novak leading the line. Rock Strauss. Nabonkiza. Nabonkiza, the Burundi international. The shot coming in. Should be easily taken by Maciej Mielkarts and is. Wolzevic it was, the Montenegrin. And Pudevuc. Good possession of their own. Ball down the line is towards Veljo Batrovic. Quick run through the Videvuc. Line up then, Virevuj playing in the all red colours, trying to record just their fourth win in the extra class of this season. Milkarts, the captain, is in goal. Across the back, it's Kazmarek, Novak, Jonathan de Amo, and Bartkowski. In midfield, it's Rai Beke, La France. There's the one change in the Virevuj lineup coming in for Kaspergek. He is joined by Lemonas. And one of the two brothers completing the midfield, that's Alexis Viznikov. His brother, Edward Viznikov, leads the line. He's the younger brother. And uh, Batarevich, the 19-year-old, Montenegrin under-21 international, plays up top with Edward Viznikov. 
Barcelony. Bardzo często w wywiadach mówi o tym także trener stawowy. Mariusz Pawlak, tuż po objęciu Widzewa Łódź, pytany, czy mu bliżej do Realu, czy do Barcelony, powiedział zdecydowanie bliżej do Realu, a więc mamy przedsmak, przedsmak Grand Derby, które jutro na ekranach NC+. Żydko. Żydko. Under pressure. Scoop pressure from Widzew Łódź. Rybicki. That looked like a handball there. Referee Frankowski, let's play continue. Ciekawe, czemu Widzew nie został na połowie przeciwnika. Gracze w szerwonych koszulkach byli blisko piłki, nie zaatakowali jednak Krakowi. Próbują organizować swoje szyki obronne na własnej połowie. Zobaczymy, czy, czy tak będzie w następnych minutach. It's 12 days straight of uh, extra class action coming up. That's how the fans like it. Game after game, two games today. Both of which will be covered by your current receiver. Later this evening, Gornik Zabsia travel to Jagiellonia Białystok through ball. Will uh, trickle all the way through to Maciej Mulekart, who remains with uh, almost five minutes played at the Ludwika Sobolewskiego Stadium in Wuj. Vida Wuj nil. Krakowia, Krakow nil. In terms of uh, league positions, the league leaders, Legia Warsawa, have uh, 27 points after 12 games. Both side on the far side against Sebastian Stablecki. Konik sits second on 25, then it's Wisła Krakow on 21. Game week uh, 13 kicked off last night. Juan Pacicki, the league's bottom side. Three, nil nil. With Rook off. Good point for Pobodzicki. Just registered just the one victory from 13 now in the league. Six draws, six defeats. Decent sliding challenge from Kasmerdzik. Can deny Saliga from getting down the line. Here's Zitko for Krakowia Krakow. Certainly coming forward with purpose on the visitors. Stiblecki. Stiblecki again. Back to Zitko. Bring the ball across the back here. Dubrowski all the way back to Pilarts. Dubrowski. Widzę w to w 100% zespół własnego boiska. Widzę Wudzior. On their last four against Krakowia Krakow. However, they also have the leakiest defence in the extra class. Having conceded 24 goals from their opening 12 games, so that's two conceded per game. So far, though, they've kept out Krakowia Krakow. Nabon Kiza on the overlap is uh, Marciniak. Tempted across is too deep and it'll be a throw in for Videvuj. That's lovely footwork by Rybicki. Could this be the game's first yellow card? Shown to the captain. Oh, Krakowia Krakow cynically taking out Marius Rybicki. Oh, Sławomir Siliga. Well, he committed very early to the challenge, did Zuliga. Cross. Headed over the top. Well, that's better from Videvuj. And encouragement from the supporters as well. Cross from Bartkowski. Header toward goal was from Edwards Wisnikovs. 
Piers McCall, seven goals this season. Seven goals for the Latvian. Krakowia pick up possession. Stablacki. Stablacki again. Gasp cha Gas challenge there. He denied Nabon Keys. It was Kevin LaFrance who made the challenge. We still haven't cleared the danger here, Vidivuj. Strauss. Nabon Keys. The rebound has fallen kindly for Edwards Viznikovs. All the way back though with Milkas. Two Latvian internationals, of course, the Viznikov brothers. The understanding, of course, will be usually, normally, a step ahead of uh, any other partnership. You would have thought. Yeah, yeah, Turi, Kolo and Turi. I think he's back to brothers who have uh, made the grade at top level professional football. Jack Charlton. It's Gary and Phil Neville at Manchester United. Another example. Brothers playing together. And against one another, of course, Phil Neville moved to Everton before his brother Gary ultimately hung the boots up. Now punned it with uh, Sky Sports. A very good one at that. Matthias Zitko. It's good ball retention by Krakowia Krakow. Strong ball looking for Nabon Kiza. He's kept that in beautifully, has Nabon Kiza. Ball round the corner. Reaches the Blackie who turns the effort over the top, but that's good from Krakowia. That will please the manager, Wojciech Stavovic. Long ball, caught out Marcin Kasmerek. Well kept in, cut back. And the back heel from Saliga. Shot though, some way off target from Sebastian Stablecki. Stablecki. Tak, to również są elementy, które otrzymujemy od trenera stawowego w prezencie. Otrzymujemy, czyli ci wszyscy, którzy pracują przy Ekstraklasie. No Stablecki na razie jest nieskuteczny, bo to był jego 17 strzał w tym sezonie. Jeszcze gola nie zdobył. Goalkeeper, clears up over the halfway line. Head it on. Trzech, Pawłowski, Podgórski i Wszyscy. Now is a chance for Wisnikov. Uh, what's the referee going to give here? Has he given a penalty kick? Yes, he has. Edwards Viznikov showed plenty of cunning and guile to work his way into the 18-yard box. Now, where was the foul committed? That's the thing. Miłos Kozanovic left out that foot and it looked as if he did it right on the edge of the 18-yard box. We, of course, have the benefit of a replay. He actually went down inside the area. And uh, referee Bartosz Frankowski, he took a minute or two to think about it. And ultimately pointed to the spot. Krakowia Krakow can consider themselves slightly hard done by there. But let's just see if that is punished by Marius Rybicki. He's the man who stepped up here to take this penalty. Right, Bicky looking for his first goal this season. Sends Christoph Pilatz the wrong way. Well, that's celebrated by the players and by the interim manager, Rafa Plavlik. 
And after 13 and a half minutes here at the Ludvika Sobolevskigo Stadium, it's Vida Vuj who took the lead totally against the run of play. I was uh, slightly surprised at top scorer Eduard Viznikov having won that penalty and having scored seven times already this season. Wasn't uh, grabbing the ball, stepping up and uh, taking responsibility himself as it turned out. Marius Vrajbicki, who's 20 years of age, fancied that. And after 14 minutes, Vidovuj lead Krakowia Krakow by goals and ill. And could this be a change in fortune for the host here this evening? Krakowia, work to do now. Having uh, bossed the opening quarter of an hour thereabouts, find themselves a goal down. Here's Jakub Bartkowski. And then another throw in for Videvuj. Leading by goal to nil. Ball into the area. Looking for Rybicki. Kazmarek. Trying to get it back. It's tied up by Strauss. Strauss again. Interception, but should run all the way through to the Krakowia goalkeeper, Christoph Pilarts. And we could run a Kelsey stopper. Just another look. See, the foul was committed outside the box. It's a difficult one because of the angle that was taken up by the referee. But uh, Viznikov obviously went down inside the box. And that, uh, I suppose, put the arm up the back of the referee. And once he pointed to the spot, of course, when Ibeki stepped up, sending Pilarts the wrong way. 1 0. Here's Saliga. Krakowia keen to get back on level terms. And they win the corner kick. Lemonis. Concedes the corner. Defending to do for Videvuj. We have a goal lead to protect here. Here's Kusanovic. Kusanovic. Into the six yard box. Ball. Up into the air. It's cleared over the halfway line. Well, the goalkeeper always had that covered he didn't get the distance on it that he might have wanted but again it's good pressuring by Edward Viznikov well, Viznikov again he's uh, proving a handful here this evening for Krakowia Dobrowski picked up by Stiblecki inside his own half. Dobrowski. Nabonkiza. Zitko. Zitko. One time Polonia Bayato. Defender. La France. Oh, 
Oh, catch your breath for a second. Has been uh, pretty busy opening 18 and a half minutes. One goal coming after 14. Penalty from Marius Freibicki after Edward Viznikovs was brought down. As a replay showed on the edge of the area, but penalty awarded. Controversial decision. I'm sure it'll be looked into by the powers that be. Krakowia in particular. Bit of hard luck for them. Nabonkiza. Stablecki, Nabonkiza, goes round La France, plays the one-two. That was good up to that point. Nabonkiza and Voljevic charging out of his area there. Was Christoph Pilarz had to be on his guard. Been really impressed by Eduard Viznikovs. Goodness me! That could have been one of those quite freaky goals. The attempt at the clearance it was from Kevin Lafrance. It smashed off his opponent, the Krakowia player, it was destined for the top corner. But thankfully, the ball had plenty of spin on it. And uh, whilst at one stage it was on target, it ended off up some way off it, much to the contentment of Maciej Mielkart, who still to concede this evening. High feet supposedly by Stablecki, but it was more like the head of Jakub Portowski. It was uh, very low. Long range effort. I had to watch it all the way there, Masias Milkites. From distance, Vladimir Voljevic is all right footed and, well, as you can see, was swerving. Krakowia intent on getting back to Paraday. Back on level terms. Krakowia, of course, uh, excelling. Having uh, finished second in Liga 1 last season. In recent weeks, having gone through a bad patch, they currently sit sixth and could claim to fourth with a victory here. Won three of the last four in the extra class. Wins over Slunt Vrakwav by three goals to nil. Jagodoni of Białystok, whom they beat 2 1. And last time out, 4 2 success against Pubbatitsky Bielsko Biała. Still they chase this game. Feeling by goal to nil. Here's De Blecki. De Blecki turns his man. Forced backwards. Oh, here's Strauss. There's options outside him, but chose to go the other way. Masiniak. Zitko. Ball down the line. Pass to Saliga. Saliga. Trying to weave his way through. Run into a brick wall. Zitko. That's good defending. Under pressure from Veljko Batrevic. Zitko. 
zupełnie inny sposób rozpoczynania akcji przez Widzew i przez Krakowie. Krakowia po ziemi, krótkimi podaniami. Widzew, wszyscy piłkarze na połowę przeciwnika. Mielca aż próbuje kopać futbolówkę jak najdalej. Jednak out. Dla Dawida Nowaka, byłego gracza Bełchatowa, dzisiejsze spotkanie to takie małe derby okręgu łódzkiego. Powinien być podwójnie. Może More than Widway through the opening half. Krakowia, Krakow, who many people would have thought would have walked all over Widewu, the side struggling, who have lost their manager. Jarosław Morowski departing on the 26th of the last month. Rafa Pavlik, former player with Bidivuj, has stepped up from his role with the reserve team. And so far tonight, it's working out well for the men in red. It's an unusual sight. Marcin Kazmarek playing left back, wearing a number nine. It's not often you see a player playing along the back, wearing a shirt traditionally worn by centre forward. A number, I should say. It's a neat switch of play. The far side. Wolcevic. Dobrowski. Saliga. The bomb keys is hugging this touchline. Teraz dopiero nieco podbiegł Wiśniakow, ale piłka cały czas jest przy nodze graczy Krakowi. Oh, what an effort from long range that was. They're not getting close enough. Widewuj. He was Kozanovic. He scored twice this season, the Serbian. Wicked left foot on him. And a dip, just another foot. This year's mule cart was under pressure. Powinna chyba trochę Krakowia poszukać gry z krzydłami. Jak na razie zbyt często środkiem, zbyt oczywisty sposób. Ta gra jest zbyt przejrzysta, dlatego widzę w bez problemu z atakami gości sobie radzi. A pierwsza połowa w wykonaniu Krakowi przypomina pierwszą połowę w meczu przeciwko Podbeskidziu. Nevan Kiesa gives cheers. Can he keep it in? Not quite. Ale starał się do samego końca. Chyba był jedynym, który wierzył w to, że można dopaść piłkę. Ale przynajmniej Krakowia może się ustawić. Jest out. Może podejść, może wywrzeć presję na... Graczach Widzewa, Żydko, Woliwicz. Od pewnego czasu Marciniak bez wsparcia. Saidi, który rozpoczął grę na lewym skrzydle od pięciu minut w okolicach Dawida Nowaka. Krakowia gra na dwóch napastników. Na Monkiza. Saidi. Kosanewicz. Pushed all the way back to Pilarch. Getting frustrated here are Krakowia Krakow. This evening came to the Ludwika Sobolewskiego Stadium and from the off tried to kick the game to our Luli hosts. Men in red have done their club proud so far. And here's the danger man, Viznikovs. Viznikov, forward pass to his older brother, Alexis Viznikov. Certainly different in stature, those two players. Alexis, the diminutive brother. Edwards Viznikov, towering centre forward. Maksymalnie uprosić, czyli zagrać na klepkę Bartkowski, Wiśniakow, ponownie Bartkowski. Ta akcja, co prawda bardziej przejrzysta, ale mogłaby być w tej sytuacji skuteczniejsza. Boliwić, Steblecki. Steblecki. Boliwić. 
Decent interception. And Novak. Dombrovsky, Steblecki. Steblecki again. Starting to orchestrate things in the centre of midfield. Sebastian Steblecki started out on the wing, but he's uh, finding that in order to gain possession, he's having to step into the hole. Well, this has been sized up by Miłos Kozanovic. Kozanovic. Well, it's audacious from that distance. Came off the Vidovuj player, Maris Rybicki. Strauss. Shot deflected the other way. My goodness, that was some good goalkeeping by Macias Milkart. The shot was from Vladimir Voljevic. Great effort from Voljevic. And it uh, hit off. I think it might have been his own teammate, Matthias Zitko. It sent Matthias Mulekarts the wrong way, but the 33 year old goalkeeper showing uh, how sprightly he is. Felsko Batrovic, back on his feet. Here comes the magic spray for Velsko Batrevic. Montenegrin. Beautiful country, Montenegro. As of course is Poland. Ball back from Zitko. And the goalkeeping by Pilarz. Strauss. Well, Krakowia will try to get back on level terms before half time. That's for sure. Here's the Blackie. Zitko. Nobun Kiza. May fall for the Blackie here. The noise levels around the Ludwika Sobolevskiego Stadium have risen somewhat. They go by the same strap line as Liverpool Football Club do in England. You'll never walk alone. And in spite of their poor performance so far this season, the fans still turning out in their numbers. The Wojciech club decorated in Polish football, four-time Polish champions. 
And the Miris in nineties. We will the wrist for a while. After the championship titles in 81 and 82, and then in 96 and 97. Finished uh, lowly 13th in last season's Extra Classa. Interestingly, twice winners of the Inter Tudo Cup. I'm quite sure they still play that competition. Well, here is Viznikovs again. Viznikovs. Oh, he played in Batrovic, but played the ball too wide, and Batrovic couldn't actually keep it in, but. Edward Viznikov continues to be the class act here for Videvuj. My goodness, he's turning shreds out of Krakowia when he gets the chance. Just the final ball lacking this time by Viznikov. 23 years of age, much younger than that. Keys is the man down this time. Yellow card for his troubles for Christian Novak. Following that, sliding challenge on Novak Keys. The Inter Cup was uh, founded in 1961 and abolished in 2008. The twice winners. Well, they're defending here, Arvide Vuj. Here comes the goalkeeper. And he's made a mess of that. And Krakowia Krakow are back on level terms. My goodness. Masses Mielkarts came well out of his goal. Timiem Dabrowski is being credited, as far as I can see, with the, with the goal. Equalising goal. And he did get the touch there. Did Dobrovsky. Where was Milkarts? The captain of the hosts came for that, had to make it, went for the two fisted punch and got absolutely nowhere near it. Jimmy and Dobrovsky with his first goal of the season for Krakowia, former Zagwembe. Player punches the air. Hugged by Stablecki. Nine minutes to go. To half time. Spiti Vuj won. Krakowia Krakow won. He sets us up very nicely. Not one of his better moments. Mil who six minutes ago made a superb reaction received to deny Boljevic's shot from going into the goal. We have a substitution here. Pelsko Batrovic picked up an injury, replaced by Princewell Okachi. That's an enforced change that I suppose the uh, interim boss, pa Rafał Pavlik, wouldn't have wanted to have made. Kachi, the Nigerian, comes on for his 12th appearance of the season. Treatment for the Krakowia Krakow player. Oh, you can see the blood there. Actually, it's not that severe. 
Nie wiem, czy to nie jest kolejny piłkarz, którego największym wrogiem jest jego uniwersalność. Bo tak naprawdę Aira Petiana ciężko jest sklasyfikować na konkretnej pozycji. Bo to tak naprawdę ani lewy obrońca, ani lewy skrzydłowy. Zawodnik pośredni, który potrafi sobie poradzić i tu, i tu. Natomiast no, nie można powiedzieć, że w jaki sposób przypisać go do jednej konkretnej pozycji. La France uciekła mu piłka. No, la France runs the ball out of play. Still treatment coming for Miłos Kosanovic. Strauss. Poljevic, three pass to Kaci, here's to Blackie. Healthier look about it now, the scoreline for Krakowia Krakow and Miłos Kozanovic having received treatment to that head injury, comes back on. Saliga, Nabonkiza. Postawić w losowaniu na największy plus meczu. Przypominam o naszej akcji facebookowej. Można głosować na najlepszego zawodnika tego spotkania, do czego zachęcamy. 6 minut do końca pierwszej połowy. Jeżeli chodzi o pierwszą połowę, na pewno nie. 10 points off the top. Ewidentny błąd przy rzucie karnym i na pewno nie głosowałbym na Macieja Wielcarza. Co prawda, jedna miała... Led by Legia Warszawa. Trenerzy mówią, że bramkarzy... Champions of course. ...z tego, co bronią, tylko z tego, co wpuszczą. Tak, i też w pamięci... And be sure that Krakowia, having equal eyes, will be looking to take the three points. And both uh, Lech Poznan and Pogenstechen into fourth position in the extra class standings. Of other ideas. W zasadzie tylko po kontratakach widzę wiacy przedostawali się na połowę Krakowi. Ty patrzyłeś na miejsce, w którym byli gracze z piłką i obserwowałem, co robi Żydko. Ten, który teraz jest przy piłce, bo chwilę wcześniej w roli prawego obrońcy wbiegał na obieg, żądał otrzymania piłki grając jako skrzydłowy. Za chwilę musiał 70 metrów wracać na swoją pozycję, czyli na pozycję środkowego obrońcy. Reminder the lead given to Videvoj on 14 minutes. He was Kazanovic deemed to have brought down Edward Viznikov inside the box when highlights and replays showed quite clearly that the foul happened outside the area. The referee wasn't to know at the time, but oh my goodness, Krakowia have come from behind. And they've gone in front here as we edge towards halftime. David Novak out of nothing has uh, scored his sixth goal of the season. Stoblecki involved through ball. Neat through ball at that as well from Marciniak. And he looked up, picked his spot, curled it past the despairing dive of Matthias Mjolkarts. And Krakowia, having been behind for 35 minutes, looks very much as if they will go in to half time, leading by two goals to one. Fine finish by David Novak, the Polish international. Superb curling shot. The thoughts going through the Vidovic players and management are now. Disappointment and 
She was taking a bit of the heart out of the men in red. Two goals within a space of six minutes there for Krakowia. Totally turned this game on its head and with a minute and a half of normal time remaining. Krakowia. If you do aren't careful, could go on to notch a third. Vuj have conceded two goals in each one of their extra class of games. Two goal average this season. Matt poor run continues. Four defeats in one win in their last five games. And okay, we're only halfway through this one. Again, they're staring down the barrel. Vuj having taken the lead through Marius Rajpiki after 14 minutes from the penalty spot. Goals from Dobrovsky. A header on 36 minutes on that. David Novak curling shot into the corner. Sees the current scoreline. Which is uh, a pretty one if you're a fan of visitors crack off. Beautiful city crack off. Visited myself earlier this year. It'll be too long before I go back. Kovia hoping to return to that fine city. Three points. Three minutes of additional time indicated by the fourth official. Three minutes for Virevoj. To get the second goal. Here's Rakstraus. There's a high elbow there. Looks at things from Marcin Kasmerek and Strauss has stayed down. The ball's put into touch. Ball given back by Vidivoj to Krakowia Krakow. Strauss. Sitko. Who's the play down? 30 year old. Showing uh, his experience there. Here's the Blackie to Strauss. Diving in late there. The Vidivuj player, Rai Peki. Kazmarek looks for options on the halfway line. What a time in the opening half, almost up. Referee, Bartosz Frankowski, blows his whistle. 
story of the half.